Vickers VA3. Sounds like the name of a new airliner, but no, it's a hovercraft being made by Vickers Armstrong, and one will operate this summer over the D estuary between Rill and Hoyling. It'll have four gas turbine engines, two to provide the lift, two for propulsion to cruise at 70 miles an hour. The VA3 will carry 24 passengers and a crew of two. The 15-mile crossing of the D estuary will take only 20 minutes, against two hours to go round by road. Any more for the hovercraft will be a popular cry in the holiday season. At the same works, the hovercraft principle has been applied to a Land Rover with a small difference. It doesn't lift clear of the ground. The air cushion takes most of the weight, leaving the wheels in contact with the surface to take the vehicle along. An additional engine drives fans to provide the air cushion, which is contained by a skirt surrounding the truck. Here's one in use as a soil sprayer. Even an ordinary four-wheel drive Land Rover can get bogged down on loose ground, wet surfaces and mud. The conversion tackles the same ground without difficulty. There are thousands of places where it'll be a boon.